What's going on guys, my name is Tom from Dread Labs and today we're gonna, I'm going to show you how to upload your IG filters to Instagram. Dread Labs. So uh, in the last tutorial we made this uh, face tattoo uh, asset basically. Um, and today I thought I'd just show you um, how to export this uh, into a proper file and have it uploaded by Instagram. Um, so you're gonna go to file here and then go to export and upload and make sure that you uh, the size and everything meets the requirements here so we really didn't do anything too special here so this will probably already be okay um, and then we're gonna go to publish new effect upload so the link will take you to this uh, page. I already filled in some of the, the um, requirements, um, but it will actually automatically put your file in here. Uh, you just have to name it, uh, choose some categories, a keyword. Uh, make sure that your own uh, your business page is the owner. So for me, that's Dread Labs. Um, if that's something that you want to do. Um, so now we need to um, uh, now we need to save this as a draft. Uh, okay, so now um, we can go down here to demo video and we can click on open an Instagram and it will send you this test link um, and you can send it to yourself in WhatsApp or whatever so you can test it and record a, like a test video on it. Um, so I'm just going to do that right now. And now we're opening this on uh, my phone and it asks me to test this effect now, uh, which I'm going to do. And as you can see, you can actually see that this camera is now uh, testing out my IG filter that I just made. Um, so now I just uh, recorded a quick video on it um, and I'm gonna airdrop that to my laptop right now so we can upload it as a test video. So now that that's uploaded um, we can go into the icon. So uh, here's the link on uh, there's a template file on your uh, making your icon because Facebook has some requirements for that. Um, so um, I'm just going to open my one in my file in Photoshop and we're going to make one uh, real quick. So we have the face icon here uh, uploaded. So what we want to do is we're going to go and remove the guidelines for now. Um, and I'm going to drag my face tattoo file in here. And I'm going to remove the examples. And we're going to make sure that the tattoos kind of match with the face a bit. Like this. And there's also a requirement um, to make an opaque layer. Uh, but we want to, uh, because the effect's also black, it's a bit more visible with on the background, basically. Um, so we're just going to make a quick gradient for it. Uh, okay, so now that we have our icon finished, uh, I just want to make sure that it, my uh, face tattoos are clipped to my mask. So, uh, because it's transparent, it will make this layer transparent as well. So, what we're going to do is we're going to, um, so we're just going to edit this out manually. So, I'm going to just draw out like a line with my pen tool here. Right click, make a selection, and just delete that part of the face tattoo. So we can just use this and now we're just going to export it so now uh, we just need a uh, information and because we are a brand with red labs we need to check this one on and now we're just going to submit and this will take up to 10 business days so it might be a while until we actually get this filter approved but I just wanted to show you guys how uh, how the uploading process of this will go um, anyway so we just uploaded our first uh, Instagram filter together yeah, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed this tutorial. Um, I hope to do some more uh, Instagram filter plugins uh, in the future. Uh, let me know what you thought of these uh, first two tutorials. And if you have any suggestions, please let me know in the comments below or join us on Discord. And I hope to see you guys in the next video.